Hello, Senior Stoner fans. This is the real Senior Stoner back at you for your car to e-rig dab of the day. Today is Thursday, everybody. Good morning. Well, I'm a little bit late today. Unfortunately, I'm going to make a confession and we can talk about it. I did too much. I did much too much yesterday. So, I don't take, obviously, my own advice. That's a big issue when a person doesn't take his own advice. So I think what I'm going to intend to do is try to stop myself before I do these stupid things. You know, it wasn't a, it was a fun thing I wanted to do, but it just ended up being too much and too long, and I'm paying the penalty now. It's a musculoskeletal thing, and I should say thank God, because rest, therapy, jacuzzi can take care of that. If it was a uh, IBS issue, I don't know if anything could stop it. So I'm hopeful that just by resting today, the real senior stoner will be uh, back to his self tomorrow. The challenge is, and I talk about it all the time, when your brain says, oh, wow, I want to do something, <coughs> and your body goes along with it, you don't know the aftermath until afterwards. So it comes back to the very, very consistent theme I have, self-triage. Understand your capabilities, understand your desires and wants, and understand what you need to do. Do a self-triage. I should not have done anything I did yesterday because it fell all on the want list, zero on the need list. Mrs. Stoner tried to stop me. As always, I'm unstoppable. And you know what? Stubbornness. This is not an ego issue at this point. This is stubborn senior stoner. So when senior stoner is stubborn, bad things happen. I get injured. I hurt myself. There's a lot of pain. But I still don't stop myself all the way because senior stoner just keeps on rolling thinking he's invincible. Well, guess what? I'm not and nobody is. Nobody's invincible. It's going to catch up with everybody. If you do more than your body can tolerate, even though you think you can, and at the time you're doing it, you might not feel it all the way. Later on, the next day, you will feel it, and it might be too, too bad to try to get out of. The situation I'm in is I'm in a little bit of a pickle, okay? Because if I go too far, too far south, it's very hard for me to get back. So I have to do a hard stop today Many of you in the same situation, you'd have to do a hard stop. Sugar, will you stop licking? Stop. Some of us have to do a hard stop in order to convince ourselves. I'm not a person of uh, moderation, unfortunately. I'm a person of extremes. So I either think all or nothing. That's kind of the way I operate personally. And I know I talk about other things, but unfortunately, I'm like many people. I can talk about it and give great advice, but it's sometimes very hard for me to catch myself in the moment and take my own advice. I'm sure many of us are the same way with our children, with situations, and we make the same mistake after we tell people don't do it. That's just how life is. But you know what? I've got to get wiser. Why should I let this happen to me every time? Because it happens every single time. I have to get wiser, and I have to start listening to my own videos, my own great advice, one step at a time. Watch yourself, because I'm not. Cheers. So what do you do? If you're like me, and you give great advice, but you don't take it. You understand good behavior, but you don't do it. You're an idiot. Me sometimes. What do you do? Honestly, frankly, I think it's human. I really do. I think that's just being a person. <coughs> After all, <coughs> excuse me, we're all flawed. Nobody's perfect. <coughs> and I bet many of us 
could tap me right back now and say, Senior Stoner, I don't take my own advice either. The challenge is, what happens when you're halfway down that path? You know, I got to do a whole rehabilitation thing right now because of one day. My daughter's wedding is coming up in early August. That is worth it. That would be worth a month of rehabilitation, frankly, to be able to attend and enjoy my own daughter's wedding. But to do things every, you know, a day with, you know, things that you think you're going to enjoy. And because I did Fleet Week, I thought I was a Superman. I'm not. Just because you did one thing, don't think you're a super person. Moderate. Take it slow. Remember the mantra, one step at a time. I went from one step to ten steps instantly, and that was a mistake. Use my example. Do not do too much. This is the real senior stoner saying, have a great day, and cheers out there. Let's all keep the pain levels down. Cheers.